Hey everyone, how's it going? Uh, this is a tutorial on how to unlock and jailbreak your iPhone 3G. So, uh, what I have here is an iPhone 3G. It's a 16 gig. And uh, a couple things to note. This jailbreak is only for the iPhone 3G. Uh, it won't work with the uh, 3GS or with the uh, original iPhone. Um, so, you have to have a 3G. Um, there are other tutorials out there that show you how to do it for the uh, original iPhone. So, first of all, what you'll need is, um, you'll need two tools, well, you actually need one tool. You need this uh, program called Red Snow, and it's been just released by the dev team, so hopefully you can see that. And then also you need to download the um, latest Restore IPSW uh, software from um, uh, Apple, or I have a, I'll post a link for that as well. So once you have these two uh, files, um, that's really all you need. Um, you'll also need the latest version of iTunes, 8.2, I believe. And then uh, have your iPhone plugged in. So, um, as you can see on my iPhone here, uh, it's uh, not jailbroken right now, currently. It's uh, got the normal firmware and everything. Um, so, it's uh, just got the 3.0 software update. So, the first thing you have to do, I've already done it, but the first thing you have to do is go to your iPhone here on screen and what you want to do is you want to hold <coughs> excuse me the option key alt option and then what you want to do is uh, click the restore button up here the restore button so now that you uh, have that you're going to want to um, click it and then you'll get a dialog box and what you'll do from there is uh, browse to that folder that you've uh, downloaded the two files into, select it, and then hit open. And what that will do is actually restore your computer, I'm sorry, restore your iPhone um, to the uh, 3.0 version. So you want it all nice and cleared out uh, when you get your iPhone ready. I've already done that, so I'm going to skip that step. The next step, once you have it uh, cleared out, what you'll want to do is go ahead and run Red Snow. So here's Red Snow. And uh, I'll walk you kind of through all this stuff. So basically, the first screen asks you to browse for the uh, same firmware um, that you downloaded earlier. And uh, it's the same one. You don't have to modify or anything. It's going to modify it for you. And you just go ahead and click Open. And it's going to pre-process in the firmware. And then uh, IPSW successfully identified. Go ahead and click Next. Let's go down with the kernel, patching kernel, okay, and remember it's important for you to click or make sure that this is clicked, install Cydia, you'll need that for the unlock process. This is currently just the jailbreak process, you have to first jailbreak and then unlock. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and click next, and it says, um, please make sure your device is both off and plugged into the computer. So. Uh, that's what I'm going to do now, is that it's actually plugged in, and like so. And what I'm going to do now is turn off my phone. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and click next. I'm going to hold down the power button, hold down the home button. And then release the power button, keep holding the home button. And all these instructions are on screen. They'll tell you on screen. Okay. And now, my phone is rebooting, and all the instructions are on screen. There we go. And right now it says, Downloading jailbreak data.
there we go. And you'll notice that this is jailbroken because it has a Cydia logo here. Let me see if I can zoom in so you can see that. There it is, Cydia. So the next step, you'll, what you'll want to do is um, make sure, since I don't have um, a SIM card in here, what you have to do is make sure that um, your iPhone is connected to a Wi-Fi. I'm going to go ahead and connect it to my Wi-Fi here. I have a um, wi internet connection. What I want to do is go ahead and launch Cydia. And up, upon launching Cydia, it's going to go ahead and actually um, reorganize, uh, compile data, upload any updates, and that sort of thing. So you're going to want to ahead and go ahead and leave uh, all that stuff going. Um, I'll fast forward this in the video. Okay, so then once that's done, we can go ahead and basically just kind of do a soft reboot of my iPhone. Go ahead and launch Cydia, and we want to choose use graphical only. Don't uh, unless you're really advanced, don't uh, click any of those other ones. Just go ahead and click Use Graphical Only. And there's two essential upgrades, so what I'm going to go ahead is upgrade the essentials. Hit Confirm. Almost there. All right. So now you have all the latest Cydia installed and all that kind of stuff. And this is where we're gonna do uh, the actual jailbreak. Oh, I'm sorry, the unlock. And what you want to do is actually go to the Dev Team blog, um, and there's instructions there. But I'm gonna show you how to do it. So from here, all you're gonna do is click Manage, and then Sources, and then what you're gonna do is hit Edit. And what you're gonna do is then hit Add. And you're going to enter in the following um, URL. It's repo, R E P O, 666. Ultra Snow, S N 0 W, dot com. And when you have that, you just go ahead and click Add Source. Updating the source. And it's downloading all the packages and it's reloading the data again. What you did was you installed a link um, from Cydia uh, to be able to download and install Ultra Snow. So I'm going to return to Cydia. All right, and then what we do is go to search. And then in here, we just type um, Ultra Snow. Ultra. Oops. And there it is. Not sure if you can read that. Let me see if I can zoom in. It says Ultra Snow. I typed it in the search field there. And then when we hit it, go ahead and tap it. And then it's going to give you the information about Ultra Snow. And I'm going to go ahead and install it. And tells you some more information about the package size and all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and confirm. And it's going to be running, running, running. And it's been complete. And it's reloading the data. All right. And then return the city. There it is. And that's basically a successfully jailbroken and unlocked iPhone 3G. Um, unfortunately, I don't have like a T-Mobile SIM or anything like that to be able to show you. Um, you know that it's actually unlocked, but it is definitely jailbroken, as you can see with the Cydia. You can install, um, you know, uh, all kinds of other third-party apps that uh, aren't available in the uh, store. So, if you have any questions or, or anything like that, go ahead and leave comments below.